Yeah, that's... That's okay. So now... Um... We might want to... Take the lower edge and scale it up a little bit. Scale it up. Take um, the edge loop that we just uh, put in there and scale it up as well. Okay. That's looking good, but we've got one problem and that's um, this edge ring right here so what we can do is we can select that and scale it in I mean there if, yeah, and this is um, you know always good to compare this to the um, reference image in the background so there is an edge and it's it's looking sharp, but not that sharp. Okay, so let me try one more thing. Let's delete that edge. Double click on that. Go to delete edge. And now what we can do is uh, check that out, how that looks. So that is a little bit too smooth, but all right, so we uh, can um, select one of the edges here, that edge ring, then right click edge ring utilities and split that. So so that's um, one thing left uh, we have to do is um, select uh, all the faces on top of that cylinder here. Okay, let's undo that. Select all those faces on that cylinder here. And um, as you can see, that logo uh, that sits, you know, a little bit inside of that cylinder here. So let's, uh, let's try to do this. So extrude that, extrude that in. And then just do another extru extrusion. So hit G on your keyboard, and um, let's just pull that in. Okay. So now go to object mode. So that's not exactly what I wanted. Let me <coughs> go back a few steps so that I have my faces selected and again hit extrude and scale it down just a tiny bit and then hit G again to extrude once more and then bring that out. Okay, so now what we should see is It's getting better, but it's not what I really want. So um, let me just try once more here. S uh, you know, split that edge ring in there, pull it out. I think that's. That comes pretty close to what we, you see on the on the image in the background. Okay, so with that done, um, we are uh, almost ready uh, with that model. Uh, so I'm going to show you in a few more lessons how to um, you know put a texture or a bump map on it so that you have um, that um, logo here and and that logo here in the middle. So all right, so let me pause the video and see you in the next lesson.